Hi guys, Abby Gillette here, and I'm going to show you guys how to set up a few things for your seven day uh, clean eating challenge group, and how to do the event invite on Facebook, how to uh, create the group on Facebook, and stuff like that, and create the documents within the group. So I'm going to screen share here and show you guys how to get that stuff set up for your uh, clean eating challenge. Okay, so what you're gonna wanna do is go to your Facebook. On Facebook, you're going to, first of all, you want to invite people to your uh, clean eating challenge group. So, then I click on events. Click over here to create one. Type in a name for it. And it can be clean eating challenge, just simple, or something like seven days to kick those bad eating habits. Then in the description, you want to say um, something like, seven days to clean eating you get shopping list meal plan and education on clean eating let's change this to you will be provided with a shopping list, meal plan, and education on clean eating. A kickstart to a healthier you. Okay, and then where um, I just usually put online, if something like that, Um, when, pick the date, I'm just going to pick a date here, and always make it public, create it, um, you want to add an event photo before you invite anybody, so you can upload a photo, um, there's all kinds of photos I've made uh, you can just Google clean eating and you can use pickmonkey.com and you can pick the layout of uh, Facebook. So it'll allow you to create a photo that looks just uh, specifically like Facebook for the um, Facebook cover photo. So that way you know it'll fit. I'll find a photo here. Um, so we'll just use this one, okay, simple. It will upload the photo and then you can go ahead and invite your people to the group. Uh, let's see. <coughs> Save changes there, excuse me. Um, and then invite and you just choose your friends and you go through and invite everybody. Do not look at someone's name and think, oh, they're never going to do this. You don't know that. Don't answer that question for them. Just invite them. And then you just click through and then you invite everybody. Um, you can post little different things in the, um, you can post different little things in the events page, um, like extra little tips and nutrition tips. Make sure they're not the ones that you are going to use in the seven day clean eating challenge. And just do that to keep people kind of intrigued and stuff like that. And might help you uh, get more people to join the group. Um, because you're gonna send your invite out at least seven days to 10 days prior to when the group starts. 
so that you can gather all your people up and make sure that everybody creates a free customer account with you. There's no reason that they cannot create a free account with you when you're giving them all of this completely free. So if they don't have the time, 30 seconds to make an account with you, they don't get added to the group. It's not worth your time because they're not going to commit. If they can't commit to making a free account with you, they are not going to commit to the seven days. So now I'll show you how to create um, the group. So you're going to go back home page of Facebook. Down here on the left hand side is how where groups are. And you'll see it says groups and it'll have groups listed and it'll say create group. So click create group. Um, put the names seven days to kick those bad habits. You need to add somebody who won't let you create the group without adding somebody. <clears throat> uh, so for training purposes, we'll just add someone here for the heck of it. Um, you want to make sure that it's public and then you create. I'm not going to create this because then I'm going to have to delete the group. But that is how you would do it, and then you would create it. I will go into a different group here and show you. How to do the reps. Oh, that is some craziness. That was really weird. Okay, so. I'm just going to use an old one of mine. So seven days to clean eating. You can see I used it a little bit of a different uh, cover photo there. And it can be whatever. Now you want to create the uh, files. You can post the Google Doc link. Um, but what I've done here is created a document. So, and it's a seven day clean eating document. Um, I uploaded them from Word because that's where I have them. So you can um, go to the Google links that I have given you and you can either post the Google link or you can go ahead and copy everything and then just create a document in your group for it. So as soon as this comes up, I'll show you how to create a document. Okay, so what you're gonna do is just control A, select that all, copy it. This is the shopping list. You're gonna go back to your Facebook here. If I can get there because this little guy's in my way. I'm over there. Where's my Facebook? Oh, there it is. So you're going to create a doc. You could paste this here by making a doc or you can copy it from the Google Doc and paste it into a Word document. That way you have that always saved on your computer and you can just upload um, a document instead of creating. And I'll show you how to upload a document too. And then this is your seven day shopping list. Just name it that. And then you just save it. And to go back to the group, click there. So that's how you would do it if you created a document. 
If you copy and paste that and make a Word document, you're just going to click Upload File. Then it will give you, pull up your thing to choose the file and go into your folder wherever it is and click on it and upload it. So you can do that either way. And you'll go through and you do the same thing. You're just going to go to the Google link for the meal plan, copy it all, go back to Facebook, create a document, or if you paste it in a Word doc, upload that file. So very simple. As far as the daily post, you're going to go to the Google link. You will just, here, click on it with your mouse, copy that all, copy it, go back to your group, not sure what's going on here, internet connection problems. There it goes. And then you'll just post it. Control V to paste it. Paste it there and there's your day one. And you'll do that for each day. So that's how that's going to work. I hope that helps you on how to create the group and create the event for the seven day clean eating challenge. Um, when people say that they're going or they're a maybe, Message them immediately once you see that they have checked that as far as under the event. Message them and say, super excited to see that you're going to join the 7-Day Clean Eating Challenge with us. What made you want to join? Ask them. Then when they respond, say, well, great. And just say, I only need you to do one thing for me. Very simple. I just need you to create a free account with me at my website. Put your website in there. It just helps me keep track of everyone that I am helping out. Or something like, it just helps me keep track of um, all my people. Very simple. Let them know it is always free. It's not like a trial thing. Let, tell them it always remains free. And that's it. And then once they've created that and you see you have them as a new customer, you add them to the group. For the uh, Clean Eating Challenge once you create the group. So you want to make sure that you create the group probably about at least seven days prior so that people have about a week to do their shopping, um, you know, and they can look at the thing. Uh, most people aren't going to want to go a whole week ahead because a lot of the stuff isn't going to last, your produce and stuff. So, um, but about four, five to four days out from the start of the group, be sure to um, create that group and anyone that has made that account with you. Um, add them to the group and that way they can have the shopping list and get started on that. So I hope this helps um, and shows you how to get things going for your seven day clean eating challenge group that every one of you as a new coach will run within the first two weeks of becoming a coach. This will help you learn how to run challenge groups. It'll help you learn how to run the challenge groups for the beach body programs. It will help you build trust and form relationships with other people, especially trust because you're offering all of this to them for free and you're still helping them. So they're going to see that you're not all about the money, that you truly just want to help them. So if you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask me. Um, know the video is a little technical difficulties, internet moving a little slow, but I hope it helps you guys. Okay, see you later.